Hey guys, in this After Effects tutorial I'll show you how to easily create a walk cycle without using any plugins. Let's get started. Our comp is 3 seconds long. First we add a background solid, which we name background. Then we trim the work area so that it starts at 1 second and ends at 2 seconds. Let's trim the background solid as well. Now we add an ellipse by double clicking on the ellipse tool and change the size to 200 pixels. Then we give it a nice purple color and name it head, which we then duplicate and rename to hair1. We change the size to 75 pixels and position it next to the head. which we duplicate and insert 50 pixels as the new size and position it next to their one. Now we duplicate hair 2, name it hair 3, change the size to 25 pixels and position it next to hair 2. Hair done. Let's give it a nice label color and trim all the solids. Now, surprise, we copy the head too, again. Move it to the solid above the head in the hierarchy and name it I. We place it on the head and change the color to white. Then we duplicate the eye and name it mouth. Position it, convert it into a bezier shape. and form a nice smile. Then we take the set matte effect and use the head as mask to get the shape right. Awesome! We need to parent the eye and the mouth to the head and give it a different label color. Now we guess what? Duplicate the head once more, name it body, change the label color and change the size to 400 pixels. Then we convert the ellipse into a BC path and delete the bottom point. That's our body. Easy, right? Now we move it down and change the color into a nice patrol. Great. Well, now we need some space for the feet and move everything up a little. Okay, first of all, we set a marker at 12 frames to split the cycle into half. Alright, then we start animating with the body layer. Therefore, we set a position keyframe at 0 and 12 frames. And in between, at 6 frames, we move the position 40 pixels up and add easy ease. To make it a loop we add an expression. One of the few I can remember actually. Loop out cycle. Awesome. Now let's move on to the head. Same game. Position keyframe at 0 frames, then at 6 frames we move the position, this time 60 pixels up. Then we copy the first keyframe. Add easy ease again. And again add an expression, this time we simply copy it. Let's move on to the hair. Position keyframes at the beginning, moving up 60 pixels at 6 frames. Then we copy the keyframes from the beginning. Add easy ease. And again add the loop expression. The reason we do all that separately is, we won't have some secondary motion. Therefore, we move the body keyframes 4 frames to the left, 
the head keyframes 3 frames, the hair 1 keyframes 2 frames and the hair 2 keyframes 1 frame. Let's have a look. Perfect. Now to the legs. First we add some guides for the floor and the left and the right border of the walk cycle animation. Then we start with creating a foot by adding a rounded rectangle. 84 pixels wide and 25 pixels high. Now we move the anchor point to the left corner. Of course give it a new label color and name it foot1. Let's trim the layer and move it down the hierarchy below the body. We start by animating the position of the foot. Set a keyframe at 0. Then at 6 frames we move the foot to the left guide. Then at 11 frames the foot moves up and to the right again. We adjust the handles a little, we want the move along the floor to be flat. Then at 16 frames the foot is on its way to the right and down. At 18 frames it reaches the right guide. At the end it reaches the position of the beginning again. Okay. Let's make sure the Y positions on the floor are all the same. And let's adjust the curve a little more. Great. Now let's add some rotation to the foot. At 0 frames it's 0 degrees. At 6 frames as well. At 8 frames we rotate it around 29 degrees. At 11 frames the rotation is around 53 degrees. At 16 frames we rotate it back to minus 30. At 18 frames it's 0 degrees again. Now we add the loop expression to both the position and rotation. Finally we copy the foot layer and move the composition to the left until the end is in the middle of the cycle. Then we trim the layer to make the comp look beautiful. And add one more rotation keyframe to make sure the foot hits the floor with uh, zero degrees. If you don't want any legs you would be done right now. The legs are done with frame by frame animation. We use the pen tool to draw a line. Set the stroke to 20 pixels before. Then we draw a straight line, move the layer down below the body and name it leg 1. Trim it and adjust the color. In this case there won't be a knee, the leg will just bend with the use of the convert vertex tool. Ok, and we got to get rid of the fill. Here we go.
For the end of the cycle, we copy the first keyframe and then move backwards. Almost perfect. Let's do some small adjustments. And change the label color, which we forgot. Now we copy the lag and copy all the keyframes to 2 seconds. Then we move the layer to the left until the end reaches the middle. Done. That's my way of creating an easy and basic walk cycle. Next step would be to create a story around it, like an environment and stuff like that. Be creative! Thanks so much for watching, hope that was helpful. If you have any kind of questions, let me know in the comments below. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe and hit that notification bell. And you all know that sharing is caring. I'd love to know how that tutorial inspired your work. See you all guys next time, bye!